Happy Thumbs Gaming. We shall. Hey everybody, it's Brian with Happy Thumbs Gaming. Today we're checking out the Dilophosaurus Territory Free Room for Lego Jurassic World. As you can see on the right, we're going to get a handful of collectibles, including a, a bunch of gold bricks and even a red brick, as well as heal a sick dino, which uh, have been a little bit of a problem for some people. So hopefully everybody's dino will be there, and you'll be able to heal him, and you'll be able to roll out and not worry about that. So here you can see where we are. We're uh, still hanging out at the Jurassic Park gate. We're going to go and spawn a vehicle right back over behind us here, and then we're going to go ahead and drive it all the way around to the next spot in the next kiosk. You ever been to a kiosk before? I have. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and uh, fire it up. There's that gold brick again. That's for the race we completed at the Jurassic Park gate. I don't know why, but they seem to not go away fully until you like load out of the game and load back. But as you continue to follow around the way, you will actually run smack dab right into the next kiosk. And uh, here we can go ahead and we see a hut and a couple of gold bricks outside of the fenced area. So we'll start there. Uh, well, actually, we're going to use Alan Grant to go ahead and dig through some doo-doo. It's a little pile, though, so no worries. And then we're going to use our uh, tracker here, who, uh, for some reason, I don't know if this is uh, an indication of how not good of a tracker he is, or if this was my game, like, weirding out, or what was going on. Oh, there we go. Maybe it was me. It could have been user error, of course. Um, I've been eating a lot of blueberries the last couple of days, so maybe my my blue vision isn't what it used to be. I don't I don't know. I'm just making up excuses here, really. But eventually, you'll follow the path around, and you'll get some bones that need to be built up. We chose Alan again because we still had him out, and you can bounce all the way to the top of the house and get the gold brick. Now, you might notice just to the left of that is a target up in the tree. Now, there's a couple targets scattered around here, and uh, most of them just give you studs. And uh, But one of them here coming up actually gives us a gold brick. But we'll get to that in a minute. Since we still got Alan out, we're going to use his famous raptor claw to go ahead and tear through the shrubs in the back behind the building. It actually gives us access to a secret area, which we're going to go ahead and hop in as Timmy. But you could choose whoever you want. Anybody who can go into the dark, that is. Once we grab that gold brick, we're going to make our way around the other side of the shack here, and we find that there is another target up in the tree. Now, I promised you a gold brick falling from the tree, and look at that. Booyakashow. There she blows. So we'll go ahead and grab that up. Now, you could have used Lex or anybody that can throw or shoot items there to go ahead and get that down. And like I said, there's a couple of targets scattered throughout this, and you do get some studdage for taking some of those out. All right, now we got to go inside the gated area to go ahead and get on with the rest of it. So we'll start off with the old sick dino, the sick Dilophosaurus here. And uh, the first item can be found right to the left of him, actually. You can smash the bones, and it actually gives us a bone for him to chew on. I guess he needed a little bone marrow or something. But uh, we'll keep on keeping on along this right side, right past the cracked wall there. And we'll actually find another tracking item. So this time we're going to hopefully follow all the way without any troubles. And wait for it. So far, so good. No troubles. And a little lefty, a little righty, a little lefty again. Oh, down on the knees to dig. And, ooh, chicken bone. Some barbecue chicken. Shaquille O'Neal will be happy with that. Some barbecue chicken. All right, you see him chomp, chomp, chomp. All right, one item left. And to be honest with you, it's so dark, I can't even barely tell what it is. But I know where it is. It's inside this red barbecue. Ooh, it's a sausage. I can't even believe how many times there's sausages references. I'm not even sure why, but there is. And look at that. Dino saved and gold brick obtained. So, booyakashow. That's good news for us. And uh, keeping the flow going here, we're going to go up to the top here. There's a gold brick, and there's a dino guy here who's, who's like, Hey, man, I need some help. Uh, the Dilophosauruses are crazy. I'm not sure that's really what he's saying, but basically he wants us to shoot these three items out of the trees. And I just kind of spun a 360 there. You can see all of them right from where we stood here. But you're going to have to switch to a Dilophosaurus to get your Hawk Tui on. So, two, one of three. Ready? Tui. There's two of three. And last but not least, Tui. All right. These Dilophosauruses are awesome. Actually, they're pretty gross and probably un unhealthy and a little bit, uh, I don't know. Anyways, uh, moving along, you remember there's a cracked wall over on the side here. So we're going to go ahead and switch to a packy and smacky that wall. And uh, it drops the outer covering, revealing a gold brick. So we're going to go ahead and swoop that up. Now, you might have noticed that uh, right around the corner from where we came in the door here, uh, there is another gold brick. 
Now, I'm not sure if you guys figured it out or not, but there is a scent trail we got to find. So we're going to go ahead and roll over. Actually, is it a scent trail or is it a uh, tracking trail? I think it's a tracking trail. We're going to use our favorite grappler over here on the right-hand side. And, oh, we pull it down and look at that. It is a scent trail. So we're going to switch on over to a raptor. And, oh, to the, yeah, get your sniff on. Ew. Smells like popcorn. <laughs> Oh, Billy. All right. So I don't know why I had troubles with this second patch over here. Um, I don't know if it was because the mushrooms on the ground were kind of blocking me from getting in there or what, but I eventually get it to work. And that takes me back over here to the third sniffer. And I'm going to scratch and sniff one more time up on the hillside here. When, and look at that. It happens to be right where that gold brick was marked on our mini map there. So, oh, uh, yeah. All right, you probably notice there's another cracked wall and a log at the very back of the level. So we're going to go ahead and switch over to that and smackaroo. And then look at that. We need to get the Hawk Tui on one more time. So we'll switch to a Dilo and aim for that glowing black and green rock. And it reveals a little grow spot or a root or whichever you want to call it. We're going to switch to Ellie, get the old watering can out and get our water on and look at that it's such a beautiful flower and look at that uh, if you haven't already figured it out there's a red brick inside now this one i believe is for the 8-bit music um i'd have to double check that but uh yeah pretty cool stuff so we're gonna run back to the kiosk right quick and go see uh well make sure that we got everything we gotta build up this dino station too because we get some studage for doing that and we uh we like us some studage that was a weird deal. I ran out with Ellie, and then you see it, like, freaks out. It's like, no, you can't leave with me. So, I don't know. Ellie disappeared. So, we'll switch back to Ellie just because uh, we wanted to keep that keeping on. And look at that. Dilophosaurus territory. All of the collectibles are now yours. So, that means only one thing. that This is going to wrap up. Lego Jurassic World. Dilophosaurus territory free from where we got all of the collectibles. And uh, hopefully you guys had a blast while we ran through these. And uh, tell me what you think of that red brick, the old 8-bit music. To be completely honest with you, I turned my music on because I have it off. And I turned that on and I didn't get it. So, let me know if it works for you. And uh, you can drop us a comment or a question over at Facebook, Twitter, or drop it down below in the comment section, of course, too. And uh, if you found this video useful, by all means, click that like video or that like, like the like video. Listen to me. I can't even say I'm trying to trying to schmooze you into doing me a favor here and I can't even say it right. So, uh, pst, hey, click that like button. That's what I'm getting at. Uh, as for me, that's going to go ahead and wrap it up for now. As always, until next time. <laughs> oh, ooh, Billy, I can't talk today. Slap.